All right, guys, Ooh. welcome to the 12th ever episode of Dope Talk TV. It's yours truly, Low Key. We got John here with me, got Jay here with Boom. me. Boom! You already know how the fuck we rocking, man. We're what's back up, with another up? episode. Um, we appreciate everybody that's watching. Mm-hmm. We appreciate all the subscribers. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? We're almost at 100 on uh, YouTube, which is big to us. You know what I'm saying? Like, in, in, in a couple months, 100 of you guys started following us. So that's we greatly appreciate it, Yes, man. indeed. You know what I mean? We we're we're back with more content. So you already know how the fuck we rock. Roll your blunt, roll your J, pack your bomb, pack your bowl, get your torches ready and vibe with us, man. Facts, facts. We got some more content today. But yeah, yeah. man, I'm smoking on some gelato today, boys. I don't know what y'all smoking on, but I'm smoking on that see. holiday pack. Holiday pipe. I spoke good on the <laughs> Skittles. That's right now. <laughs> damn, damn. damn. <laughs> But yeah, man, we're back with another episode. Um, the holidays just passed. Thanksgiving yes, was yesterday. Sir. You know what I mean? Word. My neighbor Black came Friday acting a fool yesterday. <laughs> let's get into that. Actually, yeah, let's talk about that a little bit. We we had an incident yesterday where Jay had a, you know what I mean? I had to come out with a bat. Because <laughs> my neighbor showed up to my door with his brother. Because apparently my two-year-old was being too loud for him walking around the house. But I was like, oh, fuck, yo, shit, get the fuck out of here. I turned real hood real quick, but you know, then I then I finally calmed down because my wife talked sense to me, right. and he was with an old ass lady. I believe it was his mom, but she could get it too. I told him that Yo, too. Your fact. old ass mom could get it too. Back the fuck up. <laughs> I told that back kick it right in her chest too. I don't give a fuck. You you knew what you was getting into when you came looking for it over here. Nah, for real. Yeah, you go knocking on somebody's door, fucking. Not knocking, bro. He was kicking my shit down like. He, he was looking for it. You're, yeah, you're asking for fucking trouble at that point. Bro, he he should have just stood outside and yelled, I want to get my ass whooped. Come out here, please. That's what he was, <laughs> <laughs> he might as That's well what he just was like, telling hey. you. That's all you heard? Yeah, bro. But long story short, we got it situated, you know, and I'm sure he's not going to come out here because he's going to end up fucked <laughs> up next time. And I don't want to have to deliver their fucking dad over there, Jet Li looking ass. I was like, I'm not going to do that shit. I ain't never had no problem with an Asian person in my entire life. The first guy act crazy. They're usually very nice folks. Very right. quiet. This guy's the loudest, craziest hothead. And his poor wife, I'm trying to apologize. Like, I don't mean to scare you with this bat. But your husband's trying to approach me with his brother at my house. I'm going to crack one of these motherfuckers in the face. Nah, for, yeah, you got to protect your family, mm-hmm. bro. They're coming to your property. You know what I'm saying? You he broke my doorbell. Trying to do. And I even told the cops. Like, when they showed up, I'm like, look, man. I don't give a fuck about the door, but I don't want you to arrest him, but I want you to know this, that the next time he shows up at my door, write this in your fucking little report. I'm going to fuck his shit <laughs> up. I'm like, get your little camera on your chest. That this recording is this thing on. I'm going to fuck that nigga. That's it. It's like, I will. Puñeta. Si bien aquí otra vez, lo meto en la cara ya, puñeta. No, for real, though. No, for así real. que, eh. <laughs> but anyways, go ahead. Yeah, I just had to start with that. Cause I was nah, fucked yeah, up. It ruined my Thanksgiving a little bit. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean, you couldn't wait till like the next day. You had to do it on Thanksgiving. And come over like, so aggressive though, bro. Like, like let's talk. Yeah, We're the both disrespectful adults. part of it is, what, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, why you gotta be disrespectful for it? Like, yeah. some other adulto, tiene, you know, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. <laughs> nah, for real, bro. Well, yeah, I'm sorry you had to go through that shit on Thanksgiving. It's cool. I'm thankful bullshit. John came through with the coquito though. Word. Word. Made me I forget word. about it. <laughs> You know the I best coquito I've Fact. tasted in a long time, to be exact. Word. I got tipsy. Yeah, I put cups. Toby on that shit, yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That shit was on point. I put Shout Toby out to his grandpa. That coquito shit, man. You already know. But yeah, man, uh, we're going to go ahead and get into our first subject today. I wanted to get into something that's near and dear to our hearts and most of our viewers' hearts, and that's marijuana and the legalization. God bless America. <laughs> yeah, bro. Remy, On Wednesday, members of the Congress did something that they had never done before. For the first time ever, a body of the U.S. Congress voted to end cannabis, cannabis's nearly century-long status as a federally prohibited substance. By a vote of more than two to one, members of the United States House Judiciary Committee passed legisla- legislation, House Bill 3884, the Marijuana Opportunity Reinvestment and Expungement Act. I fucks with it. I fucks with it heavy, bro. So you know what that means? Be... They got to throw out the cases of marijuana convictions that were dubbed. <coughs> I read something about that. This is new, right? Just recently this yeah. happened, right? Yeah, that shit just happened. And they were saying something about that, that certain cases and shit, they got to throw out now. Nah, bro. I heard that too, but there was a couple people that made a good point and they were saying that, like, it was illegal when it was, like, you got caught when it was still illegal. 
Like after it, it, the law passes or the bill passes is different because the law changed. But before that, it sucks. But you got caught. You know what it, I think? You got caught when it was still. Illegal. I think they could suck that's my wild. dick. I think that's fucked up though. I I mean I, I feel think like it's fucked be up like as hell. That. Like I feel like you know if you're gonna change the law, let the people go. You know what I'm saying? Let the people that got that had those those uh, cases go. Bro, it's pop. I mean, it's marijuana. It's like, plant, to bro. be honest, bro, like, alcohol's ruining lives and families out there, and we're over here trying to crucify fucking potheads. Fuck out of here, bro. For real. Bro, honestly, we have an opioid ed- epidemic. Mm-hmm. That's the real problem. Pills, heroin. You go to the gas meth, station and you, you see the Adderall. Clerk. Fuck, dog. The counter clerks be like, nodding. Yeah, at bro, gas I've station, seen like, that shit. Like, out. Yo. That's what it is. Nodding. Mm-hmm. Like, that. that's something that they need to focus on. And like. they're worried about pot. That's nah, ridiculous. nah, they know what they're doing. They're not stupid. I'll hire five yeah, stoners over five pillheads. Because I'm pretty sure the pharmaceutical companies are the ones that are low key investing millions and billions of dollars into the marijuana industry and in campaigns. Yeah, like they're they're getting their hands in it. They're not stupid. That's why they're changing the laws. The bro, honestly, let's let's keep it all the way real, bro. They would not have passed that bill if rich people didn't want that bill to be passed. Let's be real. The, 1%. the people, the people that are investing into the fucking cannabis industry, those are the people that are the same people that are investing into these laws being changed. That's true, for real, because they they wouldn't do that just for the general public. They're they're changing the laws so that rich people could benefit and become more rich off of it. For well, real, for real. Listen, I don't give a fuck if rich people become rich as long as they just let me smoke my weed. I'll pay the taxes. I mean, don't get me wrong. If the taxes are too high, I'm still going to get it from where I get it now. I'm not right. going to fucking go to the dispenser because apparently in California and Colorado, they're having that problem. Taxes are too high and they're like, people are but still yeah, making a lot of the money black on the market is The black market is always going to be king. I'm telling you that right now. I'm telling you that right now. Black market will forever be king. Yeah, it's cool. You'll have dispensaries. Um, that's where a lot of people will go to go to the dispensary. But a lot of people, once they see that price... At the dispensary, because of the taxation, you got to pay, the, you know, mm-hmm. the state's taxing you, the, fed, the, 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 you know, in ca- in federal Cali. government is taxing you. Like, you're being taxed from multiple places, so they're going to have to jack that price It's like a game bang. Up. Yeah. <laughs> and they're all giving it to you from every side. Not Uncle Sam real. and, Not you know, yeah. the, the Statue of Liberty, <laughs> they're all in there. Boom, yeah, bro. Boom. It's like, but for real, bro, like, you're just going to have to, you're going to have to figure it out. And that's what it is. There's, some so not, there's a lot say, of new laws it. getting passed, man. Like, um, I think there was one that that just passed for like Trump actually just just posted it or something like that on his wall, and it was just saying, um, Trump signs bill making uh, animal cruelty a federal crime. Yeah, and it should be. Whoa, that's crazy, huh? Because if they charge a person for killing a canine dog with the same charge as they you charge them for killing a regular police mm-hmm. officer, it's yeah. the same charge if it's, you kill a canine yeah, it dog. Is. So why not make it a felony if a person kill or hurts an animal? It's yeah. a defenseless animal, you know. At the end of the day, no, nah, you're a real. piece of shit if you do that. Yeah, Fuck I you. feel like anybody that would disagree with that is just like a heartless fucking person. So people are gonna be like, "Well, you know what, man? My fucking dog's a fucking retard, and that, <laughs> and that fucking piece of shit." <laughs> it's called. It's called. It's called Yo, the preventing. It's called the preventing animal cruelty and torture act. So it prohibits. So prohibits, no more hitting your kids, people. No, no more hit, hitting no your children. <laughs> it prohibits you from extreme acts of cruelty, <laughs> including burning, drowning, suffocating, etc. You got Jesus get the fuck out of here. Christ. That's what like why saying. do they gotta be so specific? Like <laughs> people are like, I bet you because somebody would have like read and, that and be mm-hmm. like, well, I could still fucking joke him. <laughs> 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 and I say nothing about choking. You know what I heard what they do though. Yeah, but, hey, for real. When I, hey, when I when I went to to Norway, they had oh, um, Lord. my cousin or my uncles. They had to, they have a farm, right? So they had their they had some cats, <laughs> and they had the baby. That it was making too many too many babies, too many kittens. Yo, facts. Too many kittens. It's a right? felony. Yeah. And, and, <laughs> so you know what they did, right? They just threw them down the river. <laughs> John, way to snitch on your fucking <laughs> family. Frag. <laughs> Now ice is going to Norway. <laughs> <laughs> yo, your family's gonna fucking nah, be cool. I love you guys, yo. Give their address nah, and yo, names, though. Yo, I mean, listen, man. That's why. That's why hunting is allowed in certain times of the year, certain places and hey, shit. Hey, hey, Hector, be careful. Overpo- nah, listen. Peter's it's out true. there. Peter's it's out a- there. They'll throw paint on man, you. Man, listen. See you. It, there's overpopulation. Like, let's be honest, bro. Of humans. 
<laughs> of that too. We're getting there too, but nah, like there's overpopulation of certain like animals out there, like elk and shit like that, or fucking yeah. deer. Like there's listen, bro. There shouldn't be a thousand deer just running around in one spot. Like that's not a normal population ratio. Let's that's be, majestic, though. You see, it that is majestic, a, like a sunrise, but it's not normal. It. It's not normal. <laughs> like it, all you see is fucking deer for the next hundred miles. It's like, yo, deer meat's my good too. Venison's yo, good. Yo, I just start shooting them, bro. I fuck with it's it. like the lionfish in, in Florida. The yeah, lionfish, yeah, like the man. expensive lionfish that people go to pet stores to buy. Those yes, types? those. What they're, they're like? They're not expensive. You can get them. You can native. get them in the fucking water. <laughs> There's too many. I of saw them. Deuce Bigelow. I thought that shit was expensive. <laughs> Remember? That shit, it looks Deuce fancy. Bigelow. Remember? It looks fancy. Don't look at me like that, bro. It does look fancy, but now nah, you could get you could get them bitches for free. It's like crab down here. <clears throat> you can like get crab? Cra- crab? You get that shit crab. for free? Crab. Bad. I paid top dollar. <laughs> For crab. I mean, for, oh, yeah, I'm about to say, dog. I get crab. that for free. Every day of my life, I'm married. I get shit. The more, as soon as I fucking wake up to the morning I go to sleep, I'm eating shit from my wife. Just kidding. I love you, babe. Yeah, bro. Oh, she's going to watch shout this out, shit. Shout, shout out, out to Ivy. Ivy. She's at work. She's <laughs> taking pictures. Yeah, I'm bro, sorry, babe. I made that story up, Yo, guys. I made that story continue, up. Continue. Gio's not with us either, so. He's yeah, here in spirit. Out, R.I.P. Gio, man. Nah, 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 just kidding. Nah, I had to make Gio it ain't dead, man. He's 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 alive and well, bro. Hector had me believing that though because he kept saying he was yeah, here. Yeah, I spirit. kept saying he's here in spirit, bro. But he's alive, y'all. He yeah. he was here like last time. Damn, nah, for real. So, yo, bro, y'all want to hear some funny ratchet shit? <laughs> but always hit it. Yo, seven employees got fired from a fucking Popeyes <laughs> because people walked in and they were fucking fighting each other. Oh, I seen the video. Damn. You seen the video? Yeah, we're gonna yeah, put we're hilarious. gonna put the link in the description for that one. Yo, yo, seven, Popeyes is lit. Imagine that sandwich. Seven employees fired from Milwaukee Popeyes after fighting one another. <laughs> People need to learn how to fuck. That ass. is some ratchet fucking. No, nah, but I'm not gonna lie. I'm beating everybody's ass. Ratchet I'm beating everybody's shit. ass. Yo, while everybody's doing that, I'll be in the back loading up on those chicken sandwiches. <laughs> yo, facts. I'll, I'll be selling those for like twenty dollars a piece. <laughs> They're a high commodity. They just ran out the whole city. And when they try to pin all that shit, like, oh, why the hell you steal that? I'd be like, that shit was out of control. I almost got swung at it, and I just, like, throw it completely off. I'd be like, somebody swung on me. I ran to the back, grabbed the sandwiches, I dipped. I didn't know what was going on. Dude, babe, you well. stole over 20 sandwiches. I'd be like, like I, I know. I'm telling shit. you, I got swung on. I panicked. Ran in the back and I did. I grabbed the sandwiches and I did. I got scared. What the fuck? What you want me to do? Damn. I ran in the back and I did. What the fuck? With the sandwiches. <coughs> nah, but that's some funny shit, bro. Like, that that's some crazy Yo, shit. Yo, that's happening more and more, though, in restaurants. You see the lady at McDonald's, the manager that threw the blender at the lady and fucking, like, that shit shot over the counter. It almost killed that bitch. Like, Get the that fuck shit out was like here. this. Her face was like this. It's swollen. Like, she threw the, the smoothie shit at her. Like a potato. Like the worker? Like, the, yeah, the manager threw the smoothie machine at her. At the Over other worker? Behind the, no, at, at a customer. Sometimes they deserve it. The customer started acting up first. Facts. My wife tried mm-hmm. to say the same thing, like, oh, Dito, I feel bad. I'm like, yo, she came looking for it. The manager's Listen, like, not to that's say. something that, that I say all the time. It's like, you can't tell somebody how to react to your nonsense. Somebody might just walk away. Somebody else might slap you. Somebody else might fucking throw a blender at your face. It just depends on the person, <laughs> dog. Like, you can't tell somebody else how to react yeah, to you facts. being a fucking idiot. That's facts. For yeah. real, for real. That's true. That's facts. Mm-hmm. But yeah, man. What, what else we got to talk about, guys? You know what I got to talk about? How about this Post Malone situation? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, get it off your chest because you wanted to tell yeah, shit quick. Nah, yeah. Because <laughs> I'm, I'm upset Malone? about that he won the best rap album. Mm. And I understand that Post Malone has a great album mm. and I like that album, right? But I went yeah. and I listened to the whole album, right? Let's talk yeah. about yeah. it. And then I listened to Travis Scott's Astro World, which was shut down last year and it should have won, but this year it should have definitely won. Right. And what happens? That Astro World's a raw rap hip hop. It's hip hop, it's rap. That should have got. Post Malone has said before he doesn't have a genre. Right. And I listened to the whole album. It's raw. And it has some hard songs, but it's pop. You see right. what I'm saying? Yeah, it is. And I feel like Travis There's some, Scott, like, rock shit in there, yeah, too. You know what I'm saying? It's not hip-hop. It's not but, rap. Yeah, it's yeah. not hip-hop. But you got to remember, bro, a lot of those bigger fucking, like, award shows, they're... Say They it. don't know what the fuck is really going on Say in the culture. Say it. Say what? It's because they're white. <laughs> 
No, but that's what I'm saying. They don't know what's going on in the culture, bro. They yeah, think that true. like Post Malone is hip hop, and people that listen to hip hop are like, my G, that's. Yo, Travis Scott. It's, not, it's cool music. He Astro makes good music. Yeah. Because yeah, I, I fuck with Post Malone. With Post Malone. Yes, I fuck, not, he's a dope yeah, artist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a him. really dope yeah. artist. But I. Like, like Travis Scott is hip hop. That's right. Yeah, you can't give somebody a, a pri- like an award for it being in a genre that they they don't even say they're from. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Like, Exactly. That's disrespectful to Travis Scott to shit on him. That's my point. Moving on. That's I'm disrespectful upset. to any hip hop artist that worked their ass off. Exactly, that's the point. You know what I'm saying? Because you saw that, you saw the "Look, Mom, I Can Fly" <coughs> on Netflix, the Travis Scott documentary. Yeah, he shows how much work went into that album, bro. Bro, listen, that's a misconception that a lot of people have. We could talk about that hard work and what it takes to Should get to certain places. You, you know what I'm saying? Get Remy up here, bro. But real talk, we could talk about like hard work, bro, and and the dedication it takes. Like, yeah. listen. You guys out there that see people that are rich and successful and shit and wish you had that life. A lot of you guys wish you had that life, but you're really not willing to put in the work that that person put in to get to where they're at. Mm. You see what I'm saying? Like, nobody that's uh, at that level is dumb or lazy. (laughs) Nobody at that level is dumb or lazy. They work their ass off. And they fucking, you know what I'm saying? They grind, bro. Like People have a misconception of one-hit wonders, right? right? Like, oh, that person became a star overnight. It's like, no, motherfucker. That person's been putting in work for a long time, and you just, this was the song or product that broke them through. <laughs> right. Yeah, they've been perfecting their craft <laughs> for, for years. years, probably their, half their life, if not their whole life. Yeah. And then now they, they just, they're reaping the, the benefits of their labor, you know what I'm saying? Mm. But it takes work, man. Anything takes work. Nothing's nothing is easy. Nothing comes overnight. Yeah, but at the end of the day, I think, bro, I really think that's just rigged. Like, yeah, yeah. Say it. Yeah, it is Say rigged. It. I really, yeah. <laughs> John, Say, Say it, John. It's rigged by the white people. <laughs> hey man, hey man. I get mad. The Norwegian side hey, coming man. out of him. I'm half white. Fuck you, <laughs> yeah. What what was that thing you said last time from what your country? What happened? With this Kavard. If it ain't white, it ain't right. <laughs> <laughs> if it ain't white, it ain't Yo, right. I say, I tell him, did I go from his country? And he says, if it ain't white, it ain't right. We're going to pause to a some, break. Hey. <laughs> nah, that's a doorway shit. Nah, hey, shout out. Shout out to everybody, man. No. For, hey, we don't want nobody to think that we're some racist fucks or something. We fuck with everybody. Nah, All the we like a lot of people and we hate everybody too. Yeah, facts. We, we, it, there's no discrimination. <laughs> we hate everybody equally. Let's get it right. Yeah, you know facts. Real talk. For Latino real, heat. <laughs> facts. <laughs> Hit it, John. What you got? Well, shit, man. Pretty much. I just want to let y'all know that um, for the dope top. Bet. Dope topic of the day. Dope topic of the day. Boom. Let's get into it. You know what I mean? Um, I don't have anything, actually. I don't know if you guys have anything. <laughs> 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 I'm going to sit this one out. Yeah, you guys have anything? You know what I don't have? I a don't beard. Have the, yeah, I'm trying. Real. Look at this though. You see this? A little bit. <laughs> I'm getting. I've been massaging my face. They say that works. <laughs> massaging I've your been taking. I've been taking beard? vitamins. I have um. Your beard dog. Yeah, I have yeah, vitamins to too. Where, where do you Where do you think the best weed comes from? Yeah, that that could be question of the day, man. Well, I mean, question you of the day: you where 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 does the best weed come from in the world? I ain't no snitch. You guys go down in the comments and, mm. and let us know where you think the best weed in the world comes from. But <laughs> all right, yeah. Personally, I feel like the best weed in the world comes from Amsterdam, California. Honestly. I feel like California does. You feel like California? Yeah. I don't know, man. I feel like Amsterdam just has the the best geological. You know what I'm saying? Like, I yeah. feel like the weed from Amsterdam could suck my dick. <laughs> just kidding. No, no, I'm just bro. kidding. I, no, but I, if anybody's I, got I weed from dry. Amsterdam, my address is beep. No, I, yeah, I heard that the weed from Amsterdam is really good. Cause Prove like, it. It's just fucking... It's the way the elevation of the land and shit is just perfect for growing weed and shit. What do people think? What do you think? Yeah, Amsterdam that's what I'm saying. Or, or California? Go I down in the California. comments and let us know if you no. think Amsterdam got it or if Cali got it. You know what I mean? Man, I think Cali got it for sure. Yeah. I oh, think man. Amsterdam got it. I think Cali got it. You know why? Because all the hip hop records say so. And hip hop music doesn't lie. Of course. That's what Neither does the internet. Facts. Google never lies. Everything on the internet is true. <laughs> Some people might try to argue that. 
I got my reasons. <laughs> nah. Okay. Now nah, fuck that. Everything on the internet, you got a fucking question. Like Don't ninety percent of the shit that you read on the internet, you have to question. Oh my goodness, <coughs> we live in twenty nineteen. I believe everything my president says. <laughs> Oh shit! Damn, bro. Yeah, so hey, that man, one. the election's coming up again. Oh, here we go. Oh, I shit. don't get into politics or religion. I bro. don't, but <laughs> hey, I'm gonna let y'all know I never voted. I never voted in my life. Ooh, that I should not. I wouldn't have Congratulations, said that. John. I wouldn't have said that. You want a fucking cookie? Hey, are you registered to vote? <laughs> no, no, I'm not. Ooh, wait, Ooh, let me give you a lecture here. I just my recently dog said, registered. Fuck a vote. Fuck a government. Yo, fuck it all. <laughs> I didn't say fuck the government. <laughs> Hey man, that I was just, John. I just never really had the chance, or maybe I don't know. Maybe I stop just, lying. Just tell him the truth. You never gave a fuck. Nah, I never gave a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I never, I never give a fuck about it because I feel like all that shit's rigged too. Yeah, not nah, for You're real. A conspiracy theorist, I see. Yeah, yeah. I, am, I, am I am too, bro. I am. Like I don't, I, I don't think that shit, that shit counts either, bro. To be honest, you don't think your vote counts? Fuck no. I think you're full of shit. I think your vote counts. Look I, at you. <laughs> Look at you, bro. A fine vote, specimen like you. Vote, what do you mean your vote don't vote, count? Our vote does not count to the government, bro. Trust bro. me. Like they're gonna put whoever the we're fuck Puerto they Rican. Put. Our vote counts the most. Ours, the black peoples, the Puerto Ricans, the Hispanics. Our vote fucking counts. We're the majority here. Yeah. People might people Until might want to think we're not, but Hispanics, blacks, every other race is the majority. We're not. We're not Europeans. John, sorry. That was hey, good. We're Scandinavians. I don't know what. I'm not even in the military. We're brisk of bargains. <laughs> <laughs> hey. He said we're brisk of bargains. But you know what, man? Uh, yeah, voting, nah. Nah. I'm not going to vote because I feel the same way to be <laughs> nah, honest. Nah, yeah. Nah, for real, though. I, I voted one time when I was 18. It was just because I was 18 and it was something to vote for. But I don't really give a fuck about that anymore, bro. I, like I said, I don't think that that shit really matters. Mm. I don't think it. Okay. our votes are valued. Word. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. I think the same thing. I don't think like it doesn't get my vote's not gonna change the election. Right. Yeah. That's and then I'm people right. are gonna get in the comments and light me up for this, but I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I'll respond no, to all real. those. Do it. <laughs> Hit me up on my Instagram and DM me if you want to argue this shit out. <laughs> nah, for real. Think if you really think your vote counts, <laughs> put it down there. Cause nah, we haven't seen how many elections already have been tried to be rigged. You don't think many more before that were rigged. Exactly. Oh, it's coming out now because of technology. It's like the soccer, you know, and boxing. Like, you don't think that's... that's Anything that involves Bro, sports... Bro, Don King rigged. would not lie. Definitely the mafia is involved with soccer. There's no doubt about it. Where'd you get Bro, that they're from? Involved, they're involved. Where do you get heard, those you facts guys heard from? About, you guys heard about that whole, um, <laughs> that whole Colombian team that they, was, they were on an airplane. The whole team just, like, everybody died. Like the about. whole, uh, like the whole entire squad died. You don't yeah, think there so was, was just something weird? No, nah, no, just from engine failure. Get the fuck I mean, out! Engine, so the plane crashed. Engines failed. The, they died because the plane <laughs> crashed. Not because the engine failed. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I, just find it, I just find it really weird. I don't know. Yo, investigator, should like home, should like John. Hey, I'm just. Dale, Bobby, it's okay. I believe it. Yo, nah, bro. I, I mean, it, there's a lot of shit that happens that's fishy, but nah, there's boxing matches are legendary for being fixed. Fucking basketball, that's one of the easiest games to f- fix. You know what I'm saying? If you really want to just like rig it to make some money and shit. Yeah. But that happens a lot, man. It happens more often than what people probably think. There's always big money involved when there's What's games real and what's fake nowadays? You don't know. Especially yeah, you don't. with all this shit that people do, those reels, those um, videos where you can deep fakes, where you could change your face to look like somebody else. And like they did it with President Obama, that guy from Key and Peele, Jordan mm-hmm. Peele. He did it with the voice and they put the face and it looked like President Obama was really giving the speech. But look it up, deep fakes, bro. It looks so real that anybody can make a fake video and fuck up elections that, and crazy shit. That's what Russia shit. used. Nah, bro. Have you, you know guys I mean? have you guys heard of the uh, holograms and shit? Yo, dumb they shit have holograms dumb. of like Michael Jackson, fucking Prince. They have holograms of like all the greats. Yo, that's because when that's you crazy. sign your soul like that, they're gonna make money off you even after you're gone, bro. Of course, because they own the rights a lot of the time. Like company record label own your brand. Yeah, right. You know what I mean? They'll that's f- true. Look at XXX. Right now, he's dropping a new album with all these artists like Lil Nas X. He's never met the dude. He's never 
they don't you don't know how they would have been if they would have been cool or not cool when you're putting him now because the label can't but i mean yeah they own they own it it, but your work becomes their property it's just money bro you know what i mean that's a fact that's everything is money man everything is money money makes the world go around money does make the world go around power it's been real though but yeah that's crazy man man i'm really i'm really stoned man to be honest with you. Yeah, it's gelato smoking dice, man. El gelato, el gelato. El gelato, el gelato. El gelato. Yo, check this out. I feel like people need to start lighting up the comment section a little more. Word. And don't slack and like the video. Like, what the fuck, bro? Yo, let us know no, something. Bro. Yo, just let us know if you like it or not. Yo, bro. hit me up on Instagram, though. I'll respond to that shit. I say, say something <laughs> to hey, me. Hey, I'm going to let you know. We're almost at a hundred fucking subscribers, and I really fucking appreciate that. Yo, shit. let's yeah. get to a thousand subscribers, Yo. and what do you all want? A MacBook? You want a, 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 a iPad? Yeah, let us let's know. Let's get to let a thousand know. subscribers, we're... and we'll do a live giveaway. Once we right? get once we get to a thousand subscribers, we're Got definitely it. doing a giveaway. We'll do it live. We'll, we'll you know, yeah. we'll be on a live stream, Yo, and I'll we'll do it what. live, man. I'll tell you what, we get a thousand subscribers, I'll get a tattoo of Dope Talk on. On me. <laughs> with my face. With my face. Yeah. With my face on it. <laughs> with I'm my, my face. Yeah, it's, gonna yeah. all, it's gonna be right here in my chest. Uh, with all three. With all three of our faces on it, bro. We gotta have all three of our faces. Hey, a thousand subscribers. A thousand subscribers, quick. Johnny, get that tattoo it. real quick. Yo, for real. Let so us know in the comments. If you fucks with it, get it. Let's get to a thousand subscribers. Get that uh, tattoo on his nipple. Oh, there. damn. Real nice with my face and boom. That's Low crazy. key, Remy up in that picture. Nah, for real. Nah, bro. but you know what? We we might do a giveaway, man. Nah, we no, yeah, we're yeah, definitely doing a giveaway. Yeah. For real. At a thousand subscribers, be, be you know, stay in tune and and tell your friends, share, let people know because yeah. dead ass, we're gonna do thumbs up. Subscribe. We're gonna do a giveaway at, at a thousand subscribers. Yeah. You'll have to do certain things. You know, we'll figure it out. We'll let yeah. you guys know what what you guys have to do in order to you know submit your name into into the draw, but. We'll definitely be drawing a name, and it's going to be real. We're going to do a live giveaway at 1,000 subscribers. So Boom. go down in the comments and let us know what you guys want to see us give away. If you want an iPhone, TV, iPad, MacBook, you know what I'm saying? Something. Yeah. Whatever. You know what I'm saying? An Apple Watch, something. Maybe a nice bong, an expensive piece. Who yeah, knows? for real. Who, a bong, something, yeah. man. Just let us know. For tobacco use only, of course. Of course. Tobacco use only. The green kind of tobacco that grows on a plant. The wacky <laughs> tobacco. Yeah. But not nah, for real. Like, let us know what you guys want to see. Because we're about to start, you know, we want to start vibing with you guys and fucking with you guys on a different level. So Yeah, bro. You guys been vibing with us. We want to show the we'll love right back. It. For real. We yeah, want to show we'll the love right it. back because it's love, man. We feel it. We feel Mucho it. Mucho amor. For real. But yeah, man, it's, uh, we back with another episode. It's, it's been yeah, years we're signing two. out. It's already episode 12, man. Yeah, so bro. Boom. We're moving, man. Thanks for we're rocking moving. with y'all. With Thanks us. for rocking with, with y'all. Us, for uh, real, man. Boom. We out this bitch. Boom. But yeah, Peace. yeah.